So how many planes does Nick have in his hangar? Yeah, sorry, we're in the shop here. It's, you know, we're building airplanes, so uh, trying to make a living. Like I said, we don't just build lightnings and we don't just build, uh, you know, go fast airplanes. Uh, this is one of our more ambitious projects in the shop. This is a Glasser Super 2 RG. Well, just one of the things we like to do around here. Hello, this is Nick Otterbeck, uh, Arian Aircraft LLC. Um, we, uh, of course, produce and design the popular Lightning Kit aircraft, and we run a builder's assist program for the Lightning. But one thing we also do over here on the production facility is we run a builder assist program for pretty much anything that flies. We're not real picky, uh, so if you've got something you want to fly and you want help building it, we can do that here. So over my shoulder, you can see the, the shop. Uh, we got some tools going and things running because we do have a customer in the building building a Lightning right now. But as you look out over the shop, and we'll go down and take a look at some of these, we've built air, everything from Vans RV10s, Xena 750s, um, Rands products, uh, you know, S19s, S21s, S20s. We've built pretty much everything uh, except maybe like a peat and pole or something like that. So, you know, if, if you've got one of the real popular kits out there you want help with, we certainly can help build it here. Uh, our crew is very, very uh, well versed in just about anything. Do you like hangar tours? I do. Leave me a comment below. Tell me what you think of this one. Uh, this air particular aircraft right here is one is a Vans RV-10. Uh, we've built a couple of these for customers. Uh, this particular aircraft is from Florida, and uh, they're repeat offenders. They've built a Lightning already once, and so this is their next project for kind of IFR cross-country travel. Uh, we started uh, this aircraft from uh, the first rivet, and we're going to take it all the way to the first flight for, for the, the customers that live in Florida. Uh, we've had a lot of fun building it. Uh, we enjoy our customers, they become family with us. And uh, so, you know, we, you can imagine they're with us, with our crew right next to the plane, in the plane, bucking rivets and, and uh, working in, in close proximity to each other and we get to know each other real well. So uh, we're having a lot of fun with this one. Uh, the panel is being built right now for this aircraft. And so in about three to four weeks, the panel will be completely finished and pre-wired in our avionic shop. And we'll be able to bring it out to the airplane and have the customer scheduled back in to finish it. Should take us, Unbelievably, from about here, about another two weeks and we'll have the airplane flying. So here's a Lightning. This is a Lightning XS with a Titan 340, 180 horse on it. This airplane has come back from the paint shop uh, a few weeks ago and the panel was just finished earlier today. Um, so this customer is actually not coming next week, but the week after is coming back to finish this airplane. Uh, again, most of these airplanes take us about two weeks to put back together after the painting sequence. And so our goal is after two good hard weeks with the customer and a couple of our guys, we'll have this airplane ready for our FAA inspection. So. We got several lightning projects. We just looked at one. Here's another one right here that we're putting together. This is a Jabiru Classic with a Jab uh, Lightning Classic with a Jabiru power plant on the front of it. Uh, we're actually really, really close to having the inspection done on this airplane. Um, we're waiting on paperwork from the FAA and doing some of that stuff right now. So as soon as we get that, we'll put the prop on it because it's in the way usually, and we'll get the FAA to inspect it. So we're we're very much done with this airplane. What are you building in your hangar? Drop us a few comments below. So, like I said, we don't just build Lightnings and we don't just build, uh, you know, go fast airplanes. Of course, the Iran's S21 is uh, plenty fast, but here's a uh, outbound with the Titan 340 on the front of it. We're building uh, with a customer from um, Mississippi, I believe. And uh, we are really, really close to finishing this one up. That's why it's down here by the door like the last airplane we looked at. Uh, we got a propeller to put on it and a few things to tidy up and FAA paperwork, basically. But uh, this ought to be a fun airplane to fly. Uh, we'll get it all done and I'm um, looking forward to it since I haven't flown them yet. So um, this isn't a builder assist obviously, but it is a Xena 601 XLB. Uh, this aircraft had an O235 on the front of it uh, for several hundred hours and the customer has removed that engine because it was near uh, 
uh, near an overhaul and he purchased this uh, uh, used overhaul Jabiru from a private customer and we're helping him do the uh, conversion over to this engine. So uh, just one of the things we like to do around here. So this airplane right here, we've been talking a lot about Jabiru engines and how we import Jabiru engines over here at Air Aircraft. This is a Jabiru aircraft. This is actually a J250, although they have the 230 and 430 models. And we do offer a builder's assist program for the J430 uh, model aircraft, full builder assist. It's a great cross country airplane. You can put two people in the back or bags or golf clubs or whatever you want to. Um, this particular airplane is here. Uh, because the customer has just got a brand new Gen 4 engine swapped over for his uh, original Gen 1. So that's what we've done for him. But again, builder assist, something we do, and uh, we will certainly do it on these kind of airplanes as well. So, uh, this is one of our more ambitious projects in the shop. This is a Glasser Super 2 RG. Um, one of our customers who actually built an RV10 with us. He's a repeat offender, uh, experimental home builder, and uh, called me a couple months ago and said, hey, I really want to build a Glasser. I found one, so we've got it here. Um, you can see this is the, the wing in the first stages of construction. Uh, we've got the wing skins off, all the ribs are in. We've been working on the retract system and ailerons and a few other things. Um, but this airplane, uh, you know, it, this is going to be one of the longer projects in the shop, probably, you know, eight months to a year at least before we complete this plane. But you can see we got fuselage halves left to glue together and all sorts of stuff to do. So, um, you know, if it flies uh, and you're, uh, you're willing and able, so are we. We like to tackle fun projects and this is definitely one of the more entertaining ones we've had in the shop. Hey, thanks for joining me on this episode. Let me show you who's made all these videos possible. Awesome companies like Dynon Avionics at DynonAvionics.com. AirTech Coatings at AirTechCoatings.com. Airworks at AirWorksAviation.com. And visit our website at ExperimentalAircraftChannel.com for events, our video library arranged in easy to find playlists on specific topics affiliate products, aviation merchandise, and so much more. All right, everyone, before we jump back in, if you like these videos that we are producing weekly, rivet down that like button and engage all notifications by hitting that bell so you don't miss a single episode. Remember to check out the description below this video for links and special affiliate offers available to you. Yeah. <laughs> all right, Nick, so thanks for the tour through Arian Aircraft and what you do with Builder Assist. If somebody wants to actually have you work on their airplane, uh, how can they get a hold of you and get on the list? Uh, give, us, uh, give us a look up at flylightning.net and 931-680-1781. Uh, uh, one of the ladies at the front will find me, uh, give me a call and we can talk about your project and we can get you in and get you scheduled to, to get you flying. Remember to rivet that like button and engage all those notifications. Thanks for watching this week's episode. Be sure to check out experimentalaircraftchannel.com. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Find us on Facebook and Instagram at Experimental Aircraft Channel. I'll see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching. <laughs>